Friends, it's time for another look at the weekend to come in combat sports, a busy one once again in the world of mixed martial arts and boxing. I'm going to tell you about the three fights that I'm most looking forward to this weekend. Let's go to Las Vegas. Let's go to the Cosmopolitan Hotel. Let's go to the Las Vegas debut of one Connor Ben. Yes, the bad boy of British boxing. If you've been following his saga for the last year and a half, you know that he isn't currently allowed to fight in his home country of England. Uh, all kinds of problems over there. They're appealing the appeal and it's going back and forth due to the two failed drug tests back in 2022. He did finally return after quite a long hiatus in September. Bit of a ho-hum performance in Orlando, but he is back and says that the, uh, the pressure is now off him. He got that one out of the way, and he's looking to make a very strong debut in Las Vegas. He's fighting fellow undefeated fighter Peter Dobson, who is a relatively unknown fighter from New York. This is about showcasing Conor Ben before hopefully he gets his license back in England and is able to have some big fights across the pond. He thinks that he's going to win in the first round. That's what he's predicting. Uh, we'll see. He is a very strong puncher. He is a determined young man. Wasn't happy necessarily with his performance back in September. Looking forward to big things from the destroyer, Connor Ben. We move along now later in the evening in Las Vegas. The second fight that I'm most looking forward to, uh, that would be the strawweight debut of one meatball Molly McCann. Yes, she is dropping down from 125 pounds to 115 pounds. She appears to be in good spirits, in good health, in good shape. She's fighting Diana Belbita. They fought once before. Uh, Molly was victorious, and I suspect she'll be victorious once again if, of course, the weight cut doesn't drain her, and that is the big if. So we'll see how it looks. It's always very interesting to see how someone, especially in those lower weight classes, uh, deals with shedding 10 extra pounds Meatball says she's up for it and uh, is looking to go on a run at 115. Let's see if she gets it done. And then the fight that I'm most looking forward to, it's the People's Main Event on Saturday at the Apex. It's the return of Money Moicano. Yes, Henato Moicano finally back. First time since November of 2022 when he won at Madison Square Garden. He got on the microphone after his big win over Brad Riddell. Cut the promo of the year introduced us to Money Moicano, and unfortunately, he's had some injuries since then. So he hasn't been able to build on the momentum. I can't believe this isn't the main event. It should be the main event. It's far more interesting than the actual main event of Roman Delice versus Nasruddin Imavov. It's Money Moicano returning for the first time in over a year against the always tough, the always game, the always dangerous Drew Dober. Great fight at 155 pounds. Dober coming off a nice win as well. I think this fight is going to be amazing. I can't wait for it. And then if Moicano wins, I can't wait for his promo as well. Go to BetMGM. If you're a first-time user, put in the name Helwani. We hook you up. And we are the king of sportsbooks, the place you need to be for all your combat action. Enjoy the fights. I'll see you next week.